Games and Wario. Hey everyone, this is Marlin from Games and Wario's channel and GamerRealm.com. Now I have a question to ask everyone. This is about Sonic Boom, and I know this is kind of a touchy subject, but is Sonic Boom the worst Sonic game ever? I'm just asking you guys a question because I really want to know this. Um, now, Sonic Boom is based off a cartoon series on Cartoon Network, right? And the game is developed um, by Big Red Button. So this is a different company. It's not Sega. So it's not going to have the same formula, the same speed and, and, and gameplay style like the way how Sega would do it. Um, but this game... From what I understand, we were supposed to get the review copies in for this game, and we didn't receive it. IGN, I heard that they didn't get their review copy. Um, I heard so many bad things about this game. Bad, bad stuff. Like, you know, the frame rate is horrible. Um, the graphics looks washed out. And I'm hearing from a lot of people that this is like the worst Sonic game ever created. Now, um, I know this is based off a cartoon series that Cartoon Network is um, having on their, on their network. And, um, yeah, you know, it, it, it's funny to me how a lot of people have mixed things to say about this game. Because people would say, you know, the, the graphics, some people would say the graphics is good. And, you know, it's fast paced. And, you know, Sonic is like, you know, I don't know, like super fast and stuff like that. But... At the end of the day, to me, honestly, I feel like this game is missing that Sonic formula. And the fact that Sega is not involved with it, it really, really, really shows. So, what I want to ask you guys, you know, is this the worst Sonic game ever created? Um, is this worse than Sonic 06? Because I know for a lot of Sonic fans out there, you know, they, they would say that Sonic 06 is the worst one. Uh, but as far as from a gameplay standpoint, I actually played this game at E3 and um, yeah, like it, it didn't feel right to me, you know, like it didn't feel like your typical Sonic game that we come to know and love. And I, this is a whole different kind of play style and, and environment and everything like that. But there's a lot of glitches in the game. I've seen tons of videos online. Uh, people playing the game and the environment is just like, you know, glitching and, you know, you're falling through the ground and dying and stuff like that. Uh, so it's a lot of glitches in this game. And I heard the story doesn't make any sense. The combat is whack from what I heard. Um, and yeah, you know, I know this is based off of a cartoon, but, you know, this is nothing close to what Sega would normally offer us. And like I said before, it's a lot of glitches. I heard bad story. Some review websites um, even give the game a one out of 10. I mean, we reviewed the game and the guy that reviewed the game gave it a one out of 10. Some websites, two out of 10, three out of 10. It really all depends, but I heard the dialogue is, is whack. Um, Sonic is not like himself in this game. Um, but I, I really, really want to know what you people think about this because for diehard Sonic fans, I'm a diehard Sonic fan, and when I played it at E3, I was like, wait a minute, you know, this is not touching on the spirit of Sonic, you know, this is a whole different kind of game, and it is, it is a whole different kind of game, you have this big old environment, and, you know, here is Sonic, and here is Knuckles, and here is Tails, and the other characters that are involved in it, and it's, it, it's not feeling right to me, and Sonic is not moving fast enough, um, and the game I heard is like really, really short, but the cartoon series on Cartoon Network, from what I understand, it's really, really good. You know, I've seen like a small preview of it and I was blown away. But as far as the game itself, I don't think it's ready. I don't think it's worth 60 bucks. I think that if they would have took time to develop this game the right way a little bit more, I think it would be a lot better. But honestly, if I was reviewing this game, I wouldn't give it a 1 out of 10. I probably would give it maybe a 5 out of 10, maybe 6, maybe. But the game could use a lot of work. But I really want to know what you people think about this game. Is it the worst Sonic game ever? Um, and yeah, just leave your thoughts down below. Let me know what you people think. 
and me honestly I think this game could be a whole lot better as far as the sense of speed of Sonic it's just not there gameplay is not there graphics is washed out I mean the game looks like a PS2 game alright so leave in the comments down below let me know what you people think about Sonic Boom for the Wii U and yeah I'll try to my best to answer all your comments and concerns and stay tuned for the next video Thank you people so much and stay subscribed for all the new subscribers keep stay subscribed i have plenty more contents to come and leave your your comments and let me know what you think about sonic boom rise of lyric if that's the name of it all right people i'm out peace see you in the next video